This is the last episode, so hopefully these episodes will pay off. Did he leave like Darth Vader? No, I will deal with him myself. <laughs> Mouse droids. Upgrade every time he goes through. He got the shield, he got the staff, he don't get the blaster. Yep, he got the blaster. <laughs> so cute, just little. Ha, ha, ha. It's like, yeah, I'm out of here. <laughs> Is that how mouse droids uh, handle the situation? Those are clones? Yep, those are clones. When did they formed? Give us a close up so we can see. Is it Snow Palpatine face? That's not Gideon. Those are his clones. Oh, really? He, he did all the Palpatine. Oh, shoot, that's scary. Let's go. So he was cloning himself. Okay, interesting. It's not snow. Wow, like a nice wellspring of beauty. Do you live here? Well, once the planet was abandoned, they sprouted in spots. We cultivated farms. Life persists. I've only ever seen gardens in the domed cities. I never knew the surface could still sustain plant life. All they need is room to grow. This is cool. This is really cool. Shot. This feels so rewarding and grand. And then we take back their home world, you know. Attack! 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 It's a little childhood. <laughs> cool shot. Ooh, nice.
I like how she's just fighting mid air with the hammers. That's dope. <laughs> the best parts of me, but improved by adding the one thing I never had. The force. I was isolating the potential to wield the force. And incorporating it into an unstoppable army. Before they could draw their first breath. That's why he wanted Roku's blood. Oh, they're going to Patreon guards. Face. Uh oh, Grogu's about to do something cool. Come on, kid. No. I like that the armor is only on the blaster, she's just hammering. Gonna grab the thing and just. Zzz, zzz. Good, good. That was cool. Be like, yeah, yes, yes, yes. Hand over the dark saber, and I will give you a warrior's death. Crush the dark saber. Let's destroy it. You lost everything. Mandalorians are weak once they lose their trinkets. Mandalorians are stronger together. Do the death. He'll crash it right into the cave. Like he did in season one. 
and he saved both Mandalorians. And without getting tired, that was cool. And Moff Gideon is burned to splitterines. That was cool. Now they have Mandalore back. No fishes. Well, they have the um, Mephisor down there. So let's hope you get baptized right. <laughs> Your father died a hero boy. This is the way. This is the way. This is the way. Grogu's gonna be gonna be a Mandalorian. Grogu is my apprentice. He's no longer a foundling. Add him to the song. He must remain a foundling. If his parent gave permission, couldn't he then become a Mandalorian apprentice? Yes, but his parents are far from here. If they are even alive. Then I will adopt him as my own. You are always his own. This is the way. This is the way. Let it be written in song that Din Djarin is accepting this foundling as his son. You are now Din Grogu, Mandalorian apprentice. This is the way. You must leave Mandalore and take your apprentice on his journeys. Just as your teacher did for you. This is the way. He can sense life down there. So now Grogu and Din Djarin are gonna, well, Din, what's his name? Din Grogu are um, gonna go to new journeys, I guess, in the next season. Let me buy you a drink, man. They got Dave Filoni in the background. But I'm here on business. We really appreciate what you did. You made our jobs a lot easier. It's not him, kid. One of them reminds him of someone he knew. The IG I have a business proposition. Shoot. This youngling is my apprentice. You want to work for the New Republic? On a case-by-case -case basis. An independent contractor. You know, this is against the regulation. It'll never get approved. Which is why you won't tell them. <laughs> what I want in return is that. Scrap assassin droid head? for parts and yeah. for you as well. Greetings, citizens. I am IG-11, your new marshal. Your new marshal of Navarre. Oh, they rebuilt it. I am here to serve and protect the citizenry. <laughs> I am at your disposal and serve okay, at cool. your pleasure. Okay, that was nice. Nice spot. Reminds me of the Luke Skywalker um, home on Tatooine. <laughs> okay. It was satisfying. It was good. Wouldn't change anything from it. But it was short. But sweet. Let's talk. And well, there you have it. Um, that wraps up the season three of the Mandalorian. 
um, season three um, season near episode. That episode was great, but short and sweet. Um, very satisfying. What I rate this episode is a solid 9.5 because I wanted to go last out a little longer, you know? But um, it is what it is, though, so forth. But overall, it's a whole season. I would rate the whole season a solid 8.5 out of 10. Or 9.5, not 9.5, but 8. Let's go with 8.5 out of 10. You know, because this whole season there were certain fillers, like the Jack Black episode when Lizzo I thought was okay. And there was another episode I thought was, there was two filler episodes I thought was passable, but everything else was cool. But overall, as a hardcore source fan, I enjoyed it because, like I said, this season, which I expected to be, was the redemptions of um, them getting back Mandalore and redemptions of Din Djarin being the Mandalorian. It was all about the theme of redemption, you know. And Bogotan got her people back, she got the Darksaber back and all that stuff. And also the cloners, which I thought was, was um, Snoke or Palpatine, but it turned out to be Moff Gideon. Which was a nice little solid twist and everything because, you know, it was the reason why he wanted Grogu's blood in the first place for season one. So we, he wanted to have force powers, but the question is, did he know how to use the force powers? I assume not. But um, yeah, but overall, I really enjoyed it. Moff Gideon is gone now. He died satisfying. There was there was cool fight scenes, and I love the action scenes of this episode. It was really brilliant. The Mandalorians and the Jet Trooper thing people are going to each other in the Patreon guards, and Groku using a little bit of force, which was kind of cute, you know, so like that. I thought he was going to use the force to take the um, Patreon guard stick and then just zzz, or just shove it and to kill them, you know. But it didn't go that way, you know. Like keep it disnified in certain aspects, you know. But he could have it that well. But overall, overall. It was a great episode. It was just short, you know. I, um, it wasn't as um, pleasant or satisfying like on season two when Luke Skywalker uh, approached up. You know, seasons two um, to me of Mandalore was the best, best episode, emotional tearjerker. This one, I don't know why I thought Thrawn was going to pop up at the end. You know, because we talk about Thrawn, but we'll see him in the Ahsoka um, series in the near future. So um, yeah, but overall, um, the story-wise of the Mandalorian season three, like I said. Out of all seasons, let's see. Season one, I would rate a solid nine out of ten. Season two, I rate a solid nine point eight out of ten. And season three, I would, <coughs> excuse me, I would say I would rate it a solid eight point five out of ten for season three. Very good season, slow parts and everything, you know. But overall. I enjoyed it, The Redemption of Mandalore. So that was my reactions, that was my thoughts of The Mandalorian, and I will see you guys next time in this reaction videos to doing more Star Wars talk and chat on Ahsoka, which is coming out in August, so please check out my reaction to that, and thank you guys and girls for tuning in to see my reactions and thoughts about The Mandalorian. It's been a journey, and this was the way. It was worth the trip, and like I said, I really enjoyed it for what it is and stuff like that. And so, yeah. So, what was your thoughts about the last episode? Did you love this season? Or for the season could be better or the season sucked? Please comment below and let me know and just elaborate your theories and stuff like that. And also, if you have enjoyed my reactions, hit that like, subscribe, and share button. More videos are posted each and every other day of week. And so, with that being said, this is me signing out. With a bang. Ha ha! Do 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 do